Hey guys, so today we are going to talk about Stack Overflow's recent developer polls for 2018. And specifically we're going to talk about the most popular technologies of 2018. So let's get into it. Now you have to excuse me, I'm like literally Yes, this is to, this is the first day in a week where I have I, I basically have been at death's door for the past week, deathly ill. Some vicious virus got a hold of me, and I haven't been able to, been able to make any videos. Not that it should matter to you, because you know this is exactly why I have a buffer, so that even if I I'm out of the game, the videos are still coming out. So now I have to make up for lost time, but. Anywho, let's talk about this little report. So, if you go and if you follow the news and well, the IT news, you should be aware of the, this um, yearly report that is being produced in different organizations. And Stack Overflow is probably one of the more established ones. It's one of the reports where at least I pay the most attention because they are pretty much the hub for the vast majority of professional developers in in the IT world with github being a very strong like another very strong alternative so when they have made a poll with statistics i pay attention and when it comes to popular technology the report basically i read the report and when i was eyeing over the popular like the top five things that are relevant for professional developers as 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 shown in this in this research the research was based on 100,000 developers well the feedback from professional developers well developers and the list was very simple in first place was javascript Second place was HTML, I think, and third place was CSS. Fourth place was SQL or Server Query Language. And fifth place was Java. There you have it. 2018 is all about these things in roughly that order. Now, I vaguely remember some video months and months and months ago, and several videos, where I've actually said this to you over and over and over. I've had, since the beginning of this channel, so many questions about, all right, Freddy, what should I learn? What is most relevant? And I've told you, JavaScript, HTML, CSS, a database, which is basically, say, SQL, a relational database, and Java. And unfortunately, the problem with this sort of statement is that it's very ambiguous. It's very hard for me to prove to you why this is such a good idea. All I can re all I, I can do, which is what I have been doing, is to tell you what I know and what I see and what my experiences are. So it's very nice to have something even more concrete. I mean, you can take my word for it, but now at least you have a hundred thousand developers who are telling you the same thing. Now this is of course no, no universal truth just because there's so many people who have produced the same type of result but it feels very nice for me because trust me even though you may I mean I I don't know where you are in on the spectrum of agreeing with me a hundred percent and disagreeing with me a hundred percent but I have had many different discussions with people who have been Criticizing, not criticizing, but been telling me this or that about my list and told me that, oh no, this is not right and you should be doing that instead of that. And I kind of go, I, I agree, I, I, because I see their point. I mean, there's so many different things to consider when you recommend something. And I mean, you can, it's kind of like the fitness industry of being, uh, giving out dieting advice. Every single person is different. So all you can really do is to give the general advice, the thing that is going to be true for the most amount of people. And that's what I have been doing. I, that's what I focus on. I don't care about some niche specific super corner case person who needs one specific thing. I try to cater to 
uh, to give you the sort of advice that I see being the most common thing out there in the industry. And then you kind of have to decide if that's relevant to you or if it's not relevant. But at the very least, that's what I wanted to tell you in this video. It feels very nice to be able to, to now have something more concrete than, hey, this is, these are my experiences. Because now they're not just my experiences, they are the experiences of a hundred thousand other developers. Have a great day.